Today we've got new irons from TaylorMade, the TaylorMade QI irons. We have TrackMan ready to go. We have Kevin here ready to hit some shots for you. We're gonna give you all the information you could possibly need on these QI irons. Golfers, make sure you're subscribed to the YouTube channel. If you like this video, and then tell us in the comments what you think about the TaylorMade QI irons. Hey golfers, I'm Drew Mahold of Second Swing Golf, joined today by Kevin Kraft here at the Tour Van in with some new irons. Tailor-made QI game improvement irons. Kevin, um, fascinating stuff. What do you see first when you look at these? I mean, I know because I, off camera, a little, uh, I guess, behind the scenes, if you will here, you went and grabbed a stealth. Yes. To g get yourself a little bit of a comparison on yeah. the looks. So yeah. what did you see? I mean, with me being so crazy aesthetically oriented, um, not a whole lot of difference here. Okay. Um, Size-wise, shape-wise, pretty consistent from last season to this season. Um, it does appear that the QI ten, QI's got a little less offset okay. than what we saw with the Stealth. Uh, that was really about the only thing that I could I could see a little difference in the finish as well. But, sure. Um, but other than that, it was it's very similar uh, in its in its aesthetic. Sure, sure. So a couple of things technology-wise that um, I guess TaylorMade tells us about the QI ten. Um, you're gonna get straight distance out of this, and straight distance comes from a, I guess, a design that fights the cut spin. So it tries to eliminate cut spin. So basically, I don't wanna say it's a draw bias club, but if you struggle with the slice, you might have a little bit of that, I guess, removed uh, with these irons. Yeah. So not uh, driest, not draw biased, but anti fade. Yeah, I, yeah, anti anti slice. Hopefully, yeah. Um, yeah, for the golfers that would hit these irons. Um, also, each individual head face. Um, is designed for that particular iron. So mm. the five iron that I have here has a different club face design than the seven iron, than the nine iron, than the wedge, et cetera. So, Looks um, the same. It does look the same from the outside, yes. Um, if we were to take them apart, oh, you might see a difference. Um, I see. I don't have the components with me to remove everything at this point, though. Gotcha. So, um, yeah. You'll just have to trust Taylor, maybe, I guess, on okay. that one. Um, the FLTD CG. Progressive center of gravity. You're throwing a lot irons. of letters at me. I know, me. I know. Yeah. Um, that's just what they call it. I, oh. It's not what I would have called it probably. Oh, okay. But so the center of gravity is, this is a five iron. So it's a little bit farther uh, down and back in the five iron to give more forgiveness and launch. And a shorter iron, such as a seven iron or even down to a nine iron, it's going to be a little bit more forward up. and maybe a little bit higher as well. For nice. A little bit more control there. So That makes sense. Um, those are the key technology pieces. Also of note, 28 degrees in the seven iron, which is the same as the stealth iron from a couple cool. years ago. Um, what else? I mean, anything else that we need to note here? Like we got um, we got a seven iron here that you're going to test with the stock. Was that KBS? Yep. Max, Max MT, same stock shaft as we had last year. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Are you ready to hit some shots? Yeah, let's do this. Sweet. Yeah. All right, Mr. Kevin Kraft, the QI irons. Um, what do you see when you put that down to the dress? <sighs> looks like a golf club. That's a step number one. Yep. Um, looks very similar to Stealth. Yeah. Yeah. I know you mentioned the offset difference. Yep. That's the only, really the only it, difference. It, is, it does look. It does look like it has a little less offset than, okay. than what I saw with Stealth. Um, Top line's still good. It's not, it's not big chunky. It's not small. Um, it's a it's a size iron that engenders good confidence. Okay. Standing over over golf good. ball. Good. That's so, yeah. uh, I guess the first step in, in a, you know, a golfer potentially picking one up and or picking a setup and putting it in the bag. Yeah. The confidence part. So. I mean, look, you, you look down. You want to be able to go. Okay, I can hit this. Yeah. Right? I mean. <laughs> putting like a, a bladed three iron down there and I just want to run. Yeah. Like right. I don't want to have anything to do with that. Yeah. Right? So this, this is, so this, this, this is looks, not that this is something this, more it looks friendly. friendly yeah. Right. Yeah. That's, that's kind of what we want. Okay. Okay. Sweet. Yeah. Let's hit a few shots here and we'll right. uh, get some numbers here. Make sure that ball's flying high enough. To yeah. Spin and... Holy ball speed there. Well, that's, uh, that's, it's interesting when your friends explode. Yeah, yeah. It looks like it looks like a friend when you when you set it down there, and then your friend just explodes. <laughs> that's uh, that was pretty good. That's a. That was summarized in a way only Kevin Kraft can summarize. Yeah, the golf yeah. Shot. My mind works in a very yeah, strange yeah. way for sure. Okay. I didn't exactly know what to think when you said friends exploding, but. 
Yeah, it's sometimes I meander into yeah, strange, no, strange territories. Perfect. Yeah. It's gonna go a little left. I mean, I guess it's a little bit left. I mean, it it went lefter than the last one. Smidge thin. Smidge thin. A good okay. looking golf shot regardless. Okay. Yeah. Lost a little bit of distance, yep. but that's to be expected off. Correct. Bottom of the face. Still 1-4-0 smash. The, is that going to get to 123? Oh, almost. Oh. Gosh, that's an unreal. Because you actually slowed down your club speed there, and you still, I think your 1-4-5 smash is kind of gross. It's kind of fast. Also fast. How many times have you hit a seven iron 200 yards? Huh? How many times have you hit a seven iron 200 yards? <sighs> Total, I have no idea. Carry, possibly never. Okay. Because you are knocking on the door of 200 mm. total yards here. Okay. How's it feel? Fantastic. Several shots. Yeah. Like, really good. Mm hmm. I had minor hopes, honestly. Um, stealth, to me, wasn't the best feeling iron. Okay. Um, was a really good seller. So obviously, my opinion was not everybody else's opinion, yeah. which is great. Um, I don't expect anybody to have the same opinion that I have on, on any of this stuff. Um, but this club feels markedly better than the stealth did. In my hands, hopefully in your hands. Holy smokes. There's 200. That's all we were waiting for. I had to give you just that little tiny bit extra there, dude. Yeah. Yeah. I, knew, right, I knew you wanted it. That's, uh, that's seven golf shots. Um, you can kind of see which one is the thin shot. Yeah. Um, so that's what happens with a thin shot, um, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, you got about roughly eight yards shorter on carry distance on the average. Okay. Not too bad though. Not no, too bad. When you're, no. Especially when you're hitting it that far. I mean, obviously if someone's hitting their seven iron, say 130 yards, that's right. probably going to be like a five yard difference. Right. Versus exactly. Versus an eight yard yeah. difference. So um, something to note there for the sake of having some fun here. That's pretty impressive. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> I love, I love seeing things in our 15 foot zone, 15 feet left and 15 feet right. That's, that's, that's this where I want every that's, single, that's not even 15, that's 10 basically. Right. Except no, for it's, it's five yards here, five, five yards, yards okay. here, 10 right? yards, a 10 so, yard window for all of those shots. Right. So this is what I want for everybody. Right. But when I'm practicing, this is what I want to, what I want to see for myself. Ideally, that's the, the world that yeah. we'd like to live in. So that's what I try to get for, for all my customers is right. to try right. to get them in there. Um, 122.8 on the ball speed. That's fast. That's pretty fast. It's fast. 4469 spin. 144 smash is also just bananas. Yep. Um, to total average nearly 200 yards. Um, also over 100 feet, landing angle 46.3. So yep. good. We're, we're good with the height. We're yep. good with the landing angle. Spin is a little bit on the, on the lower side, but not terribly out of the range for yeah. a game improvement club. Right? And like we've so. said, you know, there's, uh, I generally, I would say there's, you're on the maybe lower spinning side compared to maybe most players out there. There's a lot of players yeah. that spin iron no, more, I am, hit down I'm, more. I do not spin much do. except for hybrids. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, plus you're a small, a, a, a slight draw player. Yes, so right. that also works a little bit of spin. So push it down a little bit too. Most yeah. players will be able to play this given, mm -hmm. you know, the typical swing is maybe a little out to in and with more spin than that. And yeah. I think we also saw that all that distance pretty consistent too on the distance, despite how, yeah, you know, far yeah. down the fairway you're hitting this thing. It's still pretty tight on that north to south as well. Yeah. That's, I'm, I, I dare say I am quite impressed with, yeah. with this, uh, totally different sense of what this club's going to be compared to what stealth was. Mm -hmm. Um, stealth was really good for two years. We got great numbers. Um, we've got, we have a wonderful fitting system with TaylorMade that if you aren't getting enough spin, if you aren't getting enough height, uh, 
I have the ability to make the the club two degrees weak yeah. or one degree weak and and try to you know peel back things a little bit to get better performance numbers so uh you know what we saw here was 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 pretty decent for me um but whatever your situation is and whatever you need, we can go two degrees strong, one degree yep. strong, standard, one degree weak, two degrees weak. There's ways that we can make these clubs work better. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm really blown away by how good this felt. Yeah, yeah. Uh, clearly, I mean, it, well, they're, they're straight shots, they're very long shots, yeah. high launching shots. Um, that's what you need out of an iron in this category. So yeah. really good stuff from TaylorMade here yeah. with the QI irons. All right, Kevin, testing complete. QI irons. Um, again, overall impressions. I'm impressed. Yeah. I'm impressed. I I didn't come into it really thinking I would be this blown away by it, but uh, feel of this golf club was really, really good. Um, and that was one of the, your kind of drawbacks with stealth was the feel yeah, of sound wasn't I, quite I, I didn't up love to it. par for you. I didn't love it. Mm -hmm. A lot of people loved it. Great. Awesome. <laughs> no issues there. Yeah. But I, it, it just didn't blow me away. This one really impressed me. Mm. Yeah. So now the type of golfer that, I mean, there's going to be a lot of players that will work into this golf club. Absolutely. So uh, specifically, um, what type of golfers are you going to be fitting with this club this year? We're going to put a lot of golfers into this. Mm. Um, it can go anywhere from, you know, a, a low mid handicap to you know somebody that's a, a, a brand new golfer um, there's a lot of forgiveness in here it's got a good blade length it's got good sole width it's got great ball speed um, pretty much anybody can play mm -hmm. this uh, you know your, your tour players aren't going to play this but beyond that there's yeah so anybody there's, there's can really play no this. limit what no, you're saying. I mean, no if you want distance you could play this Drew. I, I saw the distance that you, you could play this I could. You could. I could. I yeah. do want distance. All right, thank you. Uh, <laughs> QI irons from TaylorMade. Yes. Uh, make sure you get fit. Uh, you're going to see some crazy performance the way Kevin did in the testing here. So you're going to hit it farther. You're probably going to hit it higher. You're probably going to hit it straighter. What more does one need than that? Um, and that's a good way to wrap it up. TaylorMade QI irons. Get your fitting. Schedule it with someone like Kevin at our stores, or you can speak with someone online as well and get all the information you need for your QI set of irons. So, Kevin, thank you for the new iron. You're very welcome. Enjoy.